If you love peanut butter as much as we do, you're gonna wanna watch this episode. Today we are making one of our go-to favourites. So I don't know about you Kimi, but for me in the winter, some days all I want to do is eat and I just crave something comforting. Um, and it's really easy on keto to fall back into bad habits, like when you do want something sweet if you don't have things on hand, especially if you're in a household like we are where you've got other people who are not doing keto and they've got treats laying around. For sure. <laughs> it's really easy to fall back into bad habits. So this is a really awesome go-to recipe, a peanut butter mug cake. It really takes a couple of minutes with a few ingredients that you likely already have in your pantry. Yeah, and I think the thing to remember in winter is that when you get cold, your brain will signal hunger to help heat your body up. So try and keep yourself warm to avoid overheating. To start off, we are just going to spray our mug so that it doesn't get, um, so your, your cake doesn't stick. Look, if you don't want to turn your um, cake out of the mug and you're going to eat it out, you don't need to do this step. But sweet you like it. For me I find that peanut butter already has a natural sweetness. Yes. So I, like I, I don't like to overdo it on the sweetener. <clears throat> and a dash of vanilla. Then what you want to do is you want to combine your ingredients. Give them a good mix because you want the egg and the peanut butter to combine with each other. Otherwise you get little pieces of the egg whites. I've found that that's something that happens if you don't mix it properly and then it's a little bit not as nice. Yeah. And that's also why you want to melt the peanut butter a little bit first. It's easier to come on. If you want to make this recipe extra decadent, you can put a couple of pieces of Davilia's no sugar chocolate in. Mm, that would um, be so good. Yeah, it is really good. But um, otherwise, it's just perfect as it is. Let's pop it in the microwave. Really good. If 
you're looking for more quick keto treats, follow us next week. I actually want to say follow us, like and follow. Okay, sorry, let me do that again. If you're looking for more quick keto treats, make sure you give us a follow on Instagram at Kicking a Keto Channel and don't miss next week's episode. This is usually my after dinner treat if I, have, if I feel like I haven't had enough food. Mm. Because this really does fill that gap.